The next set of commitments involves Pakistan. So I would like to invite to the stage Roshana Zafar of Cash Foundation, Dominic McSorley of Concern Worldwide, Alexandra Stanton of ACS Energy Advisors, and one of our panelists in just a moment, Eric Schmidt of Google. More than 20 million people have been devastated by the impact of the flood in pa Pakistan. The floods destroyed roads, bridges, homes, lands, and hospitals. Access to clean water is severely limited. And Pakistan is facing a public, public health emergency of drastic proportions. Uh, let me say, whenever you have anything like this, the first thing you have to worry about is waterborne illnesses. Outbreaks of cholera, dysentery, diarrhea. And when people start dying, almost all of them will be six years old or younger. So I want to thank everybody who's concerned about that. Our CGI members are making commitments that address immediate needs, including clean water, food, and the long-term challenges of creating jobs, rebuilding infrastructure, and spurring a sustainable recovery. The Cash Foundation commits to establish a fund for the rehabilitation of 10 communities severely affected by the flood to improve livelihoods, especially those of women, through th cash grants and microfinance, and to support the construction of clean water infrastructure in schools. Concern, concern worldwide, U.S. will meet the emergency needs of more than a half a million, 588,000 of the most vulnerable people in KPK, Balakistan, Punjab, and Sindh provinces, including food, aid for farmers, and funding for infrastructure. To establish long-term water and energy infrastructure, ACS Energy Advisors, partnering with World Water and Solar Technologies, will donate solar-powered water purification machines, which also serve as energy-efficient generators to provide clean drinking water. Google will give a million dollars to flood relief efforts and work to develop new technologies to aid in this and future humanitarian crisis, to enhance tools including the person finder that they helped to develop in Haiti, which saved God knows how many lives. This is a big deal. We need this everywhere. And also helped a lot in Chile. So all of these things our response, ours as a group, to what happened in Pakistan. I know the world economy is in trouble. I know they're further away than Haiti. But 20 million people is a big blow. And I hope that the rest of us will not forget what we might be able to do, even as we applaud what they're doing. Let's give them a big hand. <laughs> 